questions. To okay, you about yes, same same subject. Thank you, Mark. Uh, sure. Today there are some reports that Russia indeed uh, g gave some air support around the Al -Bab. Do you have any information on that? I don't. I don't have any information. On that. I, I mean, I'll look into it, but uh, uh, you know. Obviously, uh, the Russians and Turks have been uh, uh, talking, uh, mm -hmm. uh, talking about coordination, but I don't have anything to confirm. In the past, very recent past, you defined this Turkey uh, moves around the al -Bab as uncoordinated and uh, not constructive. Do you still see al -Bab, uh, offense uh, as uncoordinated and not constructive, or what's your view on No, I, I'd say now, you know, we're in regular discussions uh, with Turkey uh, on the operations around El Bab. Um, we want to help it uh, defeat Daesh. Um, I think uh, there was a recent visit by the chairman of uh, the Joint Chiefs, uh, <coughs> excuse me, Dunford, uh, who met with Turkey's chief of staff, or chief of defense, excuse me. Um, and uh, as I said, Special Envoy uh, McGurk, Brett McGurk, uh, also visited Ankara before the holidays um, to talk about the overall campaign to defeat Daesh. Um, so I can't, I don't want to discuss ongoing operations, but, uh, you know, we're obviously coordinating with them. Uh, one, one more talking point sure. that the, on the Turkey uh, pro-government media very often use and cited that the president-elect Trump stated that the President Obama and his administration fund ISIS and supported ISIS, so that the Turkey now repeating this. What's your response to this? Uh, I don't know where those claims are coming from. Uh, maybe some comments from the campaign. I honestly don't know what they're referring to. Um, I don't think uh, President-elect Trump has ever made that ex ex allegation. And as I said, if he did, it was probably from you know, a long time ago, I, and I, I don't think he's made it again. But again, I, I can't speak for the president-elect's team. The final no. question: mm. Turkey, Iran, to, and Russia promise. are going to convene this new Syria talks in Astana, Kazakhstan, yes. early 2017. Mm -hmm. Have you been invited? And I, I don't believe so. How do you view those talks? Um, so, uh, I mean, we talked a little bit about this before when they were first announced. Um, you know. Uh, look, we're not against any effort to coordinate uh, uh, more closely on the multiple conflicts taking place uh, in Syria. And by multiple conflicts, I mean uh, obviously uh, destroying and, and disabling Daesh, but also the civil war, uh, and of course, uh, you know, uh, the terrible uh, fighting around Aleppo over the past few weeks. Um, as long as it produces results. Um, you know, we talk frequently with the Turks. We talk frequently with uh, the Russians. Um, we've also long said that uh, in order to reach uh, some kind of uh, resolution of the conflict in Syria, uh, all of the stakeholders need to uh, agree and need to talk to each other. So the fact that Turkey and Russia are uh, holding these kinds of talks um, is not necessarily uh, something we would disapprove of. But the U.S. won't be on the table. And I understand that, but as I said, we're obviously talking closely with uh, and communicating frequently with both Russia and with Turkey. 